on, Coop! This game is boring. Plus, Coop never throws me the ball. Like you could even handle the heat I'm throwing, Millie. Come on, Coop. Throw the ball to your sister. Fine. Here's something you can handle. <laughs> Nice throw. Wow, what an arm. Get the ball, will you, son? But she, she. Oh, no, no, it's a goose ball. Oh, I can't even get the more dumb sister. Oh, I'm just kidding. Oh, oh this is just fun. I'm missing. My shoe. Thanks a lot, Millie. <coughs> there you are. What's the matter? And what happened to your shoe? Where's the ball? <laughs> Evil, naked, sewer rat with fangs. Horrible, hairless eyes. <laughs> Millie! It's Connor! It? Dad, Daddy, look, look at what I found. <laughs> Isn't he just the cutest kitty in the whole world? Wait, that's a cat? Can I keep him, Daddy? Oh, please, can I, can I, can I, huh? Oh, please! Hmm, he's got a collar, honey. He must belong to someone. Yeah, someone with really bad eyesight. <laughs> Sorry, Millie, but we can't keep him. Her, or it. We've got to find the owner. <laughs> Even think about it, son. But what about my ball? I gotta get it back! You know darn well that whatever or whoever enters old lady Munson's yard is never seen again. And I really don't feel like dealing with her today. Hold <laughs> still, kitty. There! Don't you look precious? <laughs> you must be so hungry. <laughs> That's better. Ugh. I've made enough posters to cover the whole neighborhood. I've decided that I'm going to call him Mr. Cat. Great name. Well, don't get too comfortable, Mr. Cat. I'm going to find your owner. Maybe Mr. Cat and I could help. Uh, sure. Goody! Come on, Mr. Cat! <laughs> Squirrel. Did you find my kitty? <laughs> we sure did. <laughs> Too bad. So sad. You found a cat? My dog is hungry. Try to swallow him whole. <laughs> Sorry, son. I guess this means we'll be keeping Mr. Cat. Goody! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Daddy. I'll take real good care of him. I'll feed him and wash him and deplete him and paint him. <sighs> I think I need something for my ears. That cat is so out of here. Let's see who you belong to, Mr. Cat. Whoa, this is one weird collar. Uh-oh. 
You've really got it out for this cat, don't you, Coop? Why would you even think of blowing up his collar? And where'd you get the fireworks to do it? Ugh, I told you, Dad. It blew up by itself. Yeah, just finish cleaning up your mess and try to stay out of trouble. Uh, cat! Goodbye, Growler! What have we got here? <laughs> Quickly, boy! Oh, man! Now my lucky baseball is gone, too! <laughs> Where she keeps all the stuff. Mr. Cat! <laughs> That's a great idea! We'll play safari! Mr. Cat, the wild garden gnome is ferocious when startled. But Big Brother's are a whole nother story. Holy moly! Thief! Thief! Move it! Oh, hello, Millie. Who do we have here? Hello, Mrs. Munson. Would you like to meet Mr. Cat? Oh, well, well. <laughs> Mr. Cat is very nice indeed. Too bad I can't say the same about your nasty brother. Alone, they're bad enough. Together, a guy doesn't stand a chance. <laughs> Mr. Cat can't draw. He's a cat. <laughs> That's no cat. It's some kind of alien. Coop! First, you blow a crater in the backyard. Then, you sneak into old Lady Monson's yard. And now, this. <sighs> I never thought I'd say this, Coop, but go to your room. <sighs> Think, Growler. Perhaps Aloysius would enjoy some sun today. No, that won't do. He and Sir Scratcher up aren't speaking. Maybe he should visit with Tom Tuttle. <gasps> Tom Tuttle's is gone. <laughs> is your brother up yet? Sourpuss is still asleep. Well, I hope he's had time to think about... Oh, Lady Munson! I'll get it. Billy! No! There you are, Mr. Cat. What have you been up to? Your juvenile delinquent son stole all of my confiscated toys and kidnapped Tom Tuttles! Coop wouldn't do a thing like that. I followed his footprints! No. Oh. But those are all left feet. We'll sniff him out, won't we, Growler? Tom Tunnels! Where are you, Tom Tunnels? Tom Tunnels? <laughs> what the? Coop! You can't hide from... Coop, are you... What are... Why? I didn't do this, I swear! Where are the toys you stole from my shed? What? I didn't steal anything from your shed. Um... <laughs> Tom Tuttles! A toy thief! And a gnome napper! I'll deal with you later. I, I, I'm sure it's just a maze he's going through. <laughs> Daddy's gonna give you up for adoption. You! I don't know how you set me up, but... 
My shoe! So that's the way you want to play it, huh? Well, I'm ready for anything, cat! You'll be sorry you missed me with that rock! Um, isn't anyone gonna get me down from here? Anyone? Anyone see my book report? It's due today and I can't find it! Such a good idea. I'm not kidding, Dennis. Ever since that cat moved in, my whole life has been turned upside down. Lauren, Harley, what are you guys doing? Making our own horror movie? The, the Suburban, Suburban Weed Whacker Massacre! Massacre. Whoa. We're transforming the face of contemporary horror. Yeah, it's gonna be wicked awesome! We're sending it to Ghastly Graves. He'll put it on his TV show for sure. <laughs> What's she trying to say? I can't hear you. Who's Ghastly Graves? Ghastly Graves, the host of Ghost Castle, the scariest show ever. It's on every night at midnight. Or is that too late for you babies? <laughs> Unless you're scared. Watch it tonight, Channel 9, Midnight. We're not scared of anything. Yeah, except spiders. Um, the dark, Old Lady Munson, candy apples, werewolves, double-decker buses, uh, sometimes aardvarks. Oh, I don't think I can sit through this, Coop. Dennis, if we don't watch the movie tonight, Lauren and Harley will know we chickened out. <laughs> Tonight, viewers, for the Ghoulish Gala, Channel 9. Yeesh, it's just a commercial. She's right. We can do this, Dennis. You can vote for tonight's creature feature. Will it be zombie cat flesh eaters? Attack of the Mega Leeches? <laughs> or vampire roller derby? None of the above. I think I hear my mother calling. Bye, See you, Dennis! Call 555-0100! Right now! I can do this! I can do this! Each call costs 75 cents, and you can vote as many times as you like! Be sure to call in right away, viewers! There's only five more hours to vote! Five hours from now? Isn't that... The middle of the night? Dad will let me stay up. Uh-uh. It's a school night. Dad won't let you stay up to watch some dumb movie. Oh, yeah? We'll see what he says when I use my powers of persuasion. No. But, it's past your bedtime. But... You have school in the morning. But... And scary movies give you nightmares. Did I forget anything? No. Told you so. All the votes have been counted. It's a landslide win with over 96,000 calls for tonight's ghoulish gala. Zombie cat flesh eaters. <laughs> Keep quiet. Well, I suppose you can clean out Mr. Cat's litter box for a month. And your Fun Station 2000. No Fun Station! My Captain Blasteroid action figure? Three weeks of litter box duty. Two weeks! 
two weeks, three days, and 12 hours, or ice cream for dad. Deal. Okay, enjoy your bad dreams. Come on, Mr. Cat, it's time for bed. that horror movie, didn't you? <laughs> I called what number? 96,840 times? It's how much per call? I'll get it! Hey, Dennis, what 
Good job. Look, it's Zombie Cat Boy himself. What's going on? Great performance last night, Toop. Better than the movie, even. Huh? Check it out. Huh? Zombie Cat! Zombie Cat! Zombie Cat! Stop! Zombie Cat! Ah! That cat is going down. <laughs> Toop, what did you do to Mr. Cat last night? He's all dusty. <laughs> You're right, Millie. Cat is dusty. Why don't you give him a bath? <gasps> Good idea, Coop. <laughs> this will fix you right up, Mr. Cat. <laughs> Look who's the scaredy cat now. 